Well, I'm all for Christmas, all the happy smiles and the wishes, and I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. Tell me one thing: Is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. Whatever we do, we will be all right. These holiday wonders will open your mind. May all your wishes tonight come true. The love I live. Good morning, everybody, and happy December first! I cannot believe today is the first of December. Christmas is this month in Australia. It is the first day of summer, and it is a really hot day today. But I am so excited because it's December first. So I'm just chilling on my couch currently with where is he, Mr. Gingerbread? Hello, and we've got a little where are you? Little Santa Claus down here too. So I wanted to vlog today because it's a very exciting day. One, because I get to open my advent calendars. It's the 1st of December and I'm so excited to open them. I have four advent calendars this year. If you didn't know, I love advent calendars. They're like my favorite thing ever. Like I love the lead up to Christmas. It's just like a little present every day and I love them so much. I even bought advent calendars this year for both my brothers because I'm like, you need to experience advent calendars. They're just so much fun. Also, I'm super excited because in today's vlog, I'm unboxing my new iPhone. I picked up the iPhone X and I've had it sitting in a box for a few days now because I wanted to unbox it on camera so today I can finally start using it. And of course, you know what that means. That means a, a new phone case collection and I already have a bunch of cases for it. It's like the most exciting part about getting a new phone for me is getting the new phone cases. So I think I'm gonna put on some makeup right now because I have a bunch of new makeup that I wanna try out. You know when you guys get like new makeup and you're like, oh, I wanna use it so badly. So I'm gonna go pop some makeup on so I can just feel a little bit prettier. And yeah, and then we'll open advent calendars. And I'm just so excited that it's December 1st. And actually, it's December 1st. Michael Buble, where you at? It's not Christmas if you're not here. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. All right, let's put some makeup on. What do I want to do today? So I've got some new makeup here that I want to try out. I don't know, I really want to try out this. This is the Huda, Huda? Huda Beauty 4 Filter Foundation, but I'm not sure if it's too light for me today. Hmm. So this is where I keep my new makeup that I bought that I want to try out so I don't forget to try it out. So I bought some MAC eyeshadow palettes and a MAC primer and there's a little, what is that, there's a Weaver palette down there. There's some Tarte goodies back there which I really want to try out. And I picked up a bunch of MAC lip liners as well. So I think we'll give these two a go today. I've gotten so many new eyeshadow palettes recently and one of them is this awesome palette look. At the like design on this this is a Kat Von D Saint and Cine palette and I got sent this and I'm so grateful I got sent this because it is stunning and let me open it up it is so cool oh my gosh look at that I'm so excited for like this side of the palette oh my gosh and like this color right here it's stunning it's so pretty I'm so excited to try out this palette and then I've got a couple of new ColourPop palettes and I love ColourPop. So this is the Element of Surprise palette and the You Have Me at Hello palette. I've never tried ColourPop eyeshadow palettes, so I'm excited to give these a go. Hello. I left my heart in California. I let it go deep into the blue. I could be happy in California. I would be fine with just me and you. done hair is done and I've got these adorable little heart-shaped hoop earrings in today which is super cute it's time for the moment I've been waiting for all morning I'm gonna start opening my advent calendars I'm so excited okay let's move over to where I've set up my advent calendars and 
Here we go. Oh my gosh, it's officially December. Alrighty, so here are my advent calendars. This year I've got this one from Kiki K. So I bought, okay, so starting off, I put these three myself and then the body shop was super kind and sent me this pink one, which I'm so excited for because I've always wanted a body shop advent calendar. So starting over here, this one is from Kiki K and I wanted to try this one because it's like a stationary one and I love Kiki K. They have the cutest stuff ever and I love stationery and I'm just excited to like see what's inside this one. So I'm excited for that one. Then up here we of course have to have the traditional chocolate advent calendar and this is a Cadbury one. I feel like it's not Christmas without a Cadbury advent calendar. Woo! Now this one is a, another super exciting one and this is from Look Fantastic and I got this advent calendar last year. So this is a beauty advent calendar and oh my gosh, when I got it last year, it was like the best advent calendar I have ever had. Everything in it was just so amazing. And then here, like I said, is the Body Shop one and I'm super excited about this one. It's so luxe, it's so beautiful and big and I'm so, oh, I'm so excited. I can't get it to stay open. And whilst I'm talking about the Body Shop, they also sent me this cute little goodie bag filled with some of their Christmas collection and oh my gosh, I am so grateful for the Body Shop. Like they are one of my favorite brands. They are cruelty free, which I love. And I've literally been using the Body Shop for like ever. Like when I first started wearing makeup, that's when my mom took me to get my first ever foundation and foundation brush it was the Body Shop. So I was like super sentimental. So I'll just go through what's in this little bag first. In here we have this little set of Christmassy body butters. So there's the frosted berries, frosted plum, and then vanilla chai body butters. And this would be like the cutest little gift set ever. And I think I'm actually gonna give this to one of my friends who I know will really love this. And it's so adorable. I love the body shops in gift packaging. Oops. And then another adorable gift is this little box. And in here is, what is this? So this has a strawberry shower gel, a strawberry lotion, and then I'm pretty sure at the back there is a, a little loofah. So again, this is an adorable little gift set. And I remember I used to get these for Christmas when I was younger and I used to love them. Next in here is a, a body lotion and this is the Frosted Plum Lotions. This is one of their Christmassy ones. And I love the Body Shop's lotions. I have one on today. I think it's the Shea Butter one. I love how quickly they absorb and they always smell incredible. Let's see what this one smells like. Hang on, I need to set you up somewhere. I'm trying to balance you on top of an advent calendar but I don't think it's gonna work. nope I'm balancing you on top of an advent calendar okay I want to see what this one smells like so this is the frosted plum body lotion oh my gosh oh that is that is like oh my gosh that is incredible and I totally got some on the end of my nose but I'm obsessed with that scent it is so like sweet but it's not like over sweet it just smells like delicious I just want to like put this all over my body oh my gosh I am excited for this so this is the vanilla chai shower gel so this is a Christmas one again and what is this gonna smell like I love vanilla oh my gosh that is delicious oh it smells like really warm and very vanilla -y and very wintry and very Christmassy Oh my gosh, I'm gonna pop that in the shower so I can start using that straight away because that smells like straight up Christmas. <laughs> Next in here is the Frosted Plum Exfoliating Sugar Body Scrub and I love a good body scrub and it's got the really pretty Christmassy, come on, focus, focus, really pretty Christmassy logo on a top and let's see what this one smells like. I know, I think it's gonna smell like the body lotion that I smelled before. Ooh, this looks like an awesome scrub texture. Oh my gosh. It smells so good. I love these scents. Oh my gosh, the Body Shop's scents this year are amazing. And then the last thing in the bag, and this looks like it's gonna be cranberry. What is this? Frosted Berries Softening Body Butter. So this is with 24 hour intense moisture for dry skin with cranberry seed oil from North America. Eek! I love the Body Shop's body butters. Oh, that smells so sweet. Oh my gosh, I love that. Thank you so much, The Body Shop. You guys are the sweetest people out there and you've just made Christmas so much better. All right, so I think I'm gonna start with the Beauty in Wonderland Look Fantastic Advent Calendar. So let's just get these ones out of the way. So I'm just gonna open up. Oh my gosh, this is stunning. Look 
at the illustrations on this advent calendar and they've got like little drawers and in the drawers I like the little boxes with the goodies inside alrighty here we go so opening up this drawer and I'm guessing number one's in here so there's box number one so as oh my gosh look at the size of number 25 I am excited for that one but starting off with number one let's go ahead and take this out and then we can just push the little drawer back in and close it back up again oh my gosh that is adorable I love this alrighty so opening up box number one. Oh my gosh I'm so excited and it's wrapped in paper so it's definitely like opening a gift what is this? Oh my gosh, it's an Illamasqua marbled lipstick. <gasps> that is so exciting. So this is in the shade Vixen and is it gonna be like a super Christmassy color? Oh, I'm so excited and I totally can't open this. Ah! So here we go, here is the Illamasqua lipstick and oh my gosh, I've never seen anything like this. So it is a very Christmassy red color but then there's like a marbled effect through it. I don't know if you can really see that, but I'm not sure what that's gonna look like on the lips, but I'm super excited. I really love the brand Illamasqua, so this advent calendar is off to a super good start. Ah, I'm so excited. Alrighty, so next I'm gonna move on to the Kiki K1. So opening this up, where's number one? Hmm, can you see number one? Okay, there it is, number one. You guys probably found it a long time before me, but let's open up number one. What is this? Is this instant snow? No. Oh my gosh! <gasps> that is so cute! It's a little Christmas tree ornament. And it's like super good quality. It's gold and it's like got the Kiki K engraving on the side. It's like super heavy so you know it's like good quality and everything. And I'm so putting this on my tree. Alrighty, let's do the chocolate one next. So let's find number one. Where are you? There you are, number one, down the bottom. Here we go. Ooh, what is that? It's a little sleigh. <laughs> and then in the little window, it says, ho, 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 24 days to go. Alrighty, so now for the super exciting body shop one. So this one is pink, which I love. So I'm just gonna open it up first. And here is all the little boxes with all the little goodies inside. Okay, let's find number one. There it is. See, I'm getting better already. I found it so quickly. <laughs> so I'm just gonna pull this out. Oh, and I like how they've stacked it so they like all don't fall down. Oh, this is so cute. On the back of it, it says, smile at the first person you see today. And I haven't left my house yet today, but I will definitely smile at the first person I see. Okay, let's open this one up. Ooh. It looks like a little shower gel. Okay, so in day number one is the Body Shop the British Rose Shower Gel. And this is a really good size, I think. Mmm, that smells delicious. Oh, that smells very like luxurious and everything like that. I am so excited. I am so excited for tomorrow now. Oh my gosh, those were all such good little goodies. And I just know that it's gonna get better and better. And this is just making the lead up to Christmas so much more fun. Do you guys like my new sign? So weird. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I kinda wanna unbox my iPhone now so I can start using it. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. So uh, let's go and get it. So here's all my iPhone cases that I've gotten so far for it. And then here is the actual iPhone itself. So let's go open it up and hopefully this is good. I've heard mixed reviews about it, but I don't know. Let's have a look. So here's some of my cases, I'm not gonna show you like all of them because I definitely want to do like a phone case collection. So these three are from Lex Addiction and these are the people that do the really blingy phone cases and that's what I think I'm in the mood for so let's see if we can open it. Ooh so this is the first Lux Addiction one I bought and this one's just pink and sparkly. Okay oh I think I'm gonna use this one. This is the second one I bought and this is totally pink and totally just magical. Look at that. Ah, that's so pretty. Okay, this is like the princess themed case because I always feel like I need a princess themed case, but I think I'm gonna put this one on my phone first because that one's just like speaking to me. Alrighty, I am so excited for this. Oh my gosh, I had this sitting here for like a few days because I wanted to unbox it on my camera so I can finally open it. So, da -da -da. okay, that's so funny how they just like, strap it in there. It's like secured with like a seatbelt in there. <laughs> so this is the iPhone X and I got mine and I think the silvery color and this is the 256 
gigabyte one and I'm super excited to open it. So here it is in the box and I'm just going to pull this little tab. Oh my gosh, this is like always the most satisfying part. Mm. Oh my gosh, there it is. I really don't want it to just like fall out of the box. <laughs> That'd be my luck. Here it is. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful with no fingerprints on it. Da -da -da. Alrighty, so just taking the iPhone out. Ooh, that feels nice. I feel like it's slightly bigger than the 7. Where is my phone? Hang on. <laughs> Let me compare the pair. Got my 7 here and look at the pretty case I had on it. This is one from Lux Addiction as well. As you can tell, I'm addicted to a blingy phone cases. So these are really similar in size, which I like. I was afraid that like the iPhone X would be a lot bigger, but it's not. Ooh, look at it. Like takes up the whole screen. That is so cool. And it is so weird that there's no button. Ooh. Alrighty, I'm gonna set this up and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and my iPhone, I think is now set up. I've set up like the face ID thing. So just looking at my phone now unlocks it. It's like, I'm. I'm really not sure how it works. I'm not used to having a phone with no buttons at all. I miss my home button. Can I please have my home button back? <laughs> to be honest, I'm just really excited about the case. Look how pretty and sparkly and just extra it is. Ah, that's so fun. This is what it looks like. So the screen is like the whole front face of the phone, which is really awesome. I'm excited to try out the camera on this and look at my cute Christmassy background. It says, baby, it's cold outside, which is like one of my favorite Christmas songs. To be honest, what I'm most excited to take photos of with this new camera is my dog. <laughs> this afternoon, I want to go out and visit my little puppy, Echo. A lot of you guys ask about like where Echo is and she lives at home with my mom, but I visit her like nearly every single day. I love her so much. She's like my favorite thing in the entire world and I see her so, so much. So don't worry about like me not seeing her or anything. She's still a very big part of my life. And actually at the moment we have two dogs at home because we are currently looking after someone else's dog because their dog is a bit unwell and they're unable to look after them. So we've taken her in and her name is Buttons and she is a spoodle. So she's a spaniel cross poodle. Anyway, so she's a bit unwell at the moment, so we're looking after her right now and spending a lot of time with her, just trying to get her to eat and um, get her strength back and everything like that. So because we've just had a lot going on with that, I don't think I'm gonna have a new video going up this weekend, which is really sad. I really wanted a super Christmassy video to go up on my main channel this weekend, but it might just have to go up midweek just because I don't wanna like put up something that I'm not happy with. So don't worry, the video will still be coming. It'll just be coming a little bit later. Slow down, Echo! Oh! <laughs> no. Hi! Okay, bye! So I'm out at Mum's house now with the doggies! Hello! Hi! Hi, Buttons! Hello, you fluffy puppy! Hi, Echo! Hi, baby! <laughs> Echo, 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 come here! Come on! Hello, gorgeous! Hi! Hi, 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 hi. You feeling better? Hello. Hi, Echo. Hello, gorgeous. Oh, that's my good girl. Huh? Alrighty, so I think we're gonna end today's vlog here. I'm just gonna hang out with my dogs now. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.